It's time once again for Fan Friday, otherwise known as Ask GTTSD. A lot of you guys have been asking, where the heck is Ask GTTSD? Well, here it is. It's back. Is this a series that you guys want us to keep doing? Let us know down in the comments below if we should keep doing this or if we should come up with a new idea. We're gone to the snow dogs. But for right now, Let's get to some questions, and we have a whole lot of mail that got backed up during the holidays that we're going to open from you guys. So a few questions, and then some mail. What? What? Can I help you? Let's get to it. So normally we'd be doing this outside, but it's been cold and windy and insanely cold, so we're stuck doing this inside today. If you're new to this channel, this is Memphis, that is Oakley, this is Shelby, and my name's Jess, and today is Fan Friday. Today is the day where we answer questions submitted by you guys. <laughs> to submit a question, all you have to do is leave a question in the comments down below using the hashtag AskGTTSD. What, am I not talking to you? Am I trying to talk over you? Anyway, leave a question down in the comments below using the hashtag AskGTTSD, and next week we just might answer one of your questions. Let's get to it! For this episode of Ask GTTSD, we actually got questions from people in our audience group on Facebook. If you aren't a part of the group, I'll put a link down in the video description below so you can join. Dan wants to know, do the girls notice their husky buddies when you watch other YouTube channels? Uh, yes. And actually, if you watch us at youtube.com slash snowdogsvlogs, we've actually showed this a few times. Memphis knows Mike's voice and knows Nora's voice. Shelby has watched Thor before, even Oakley. They all seem to know when it's their friends that are on the screen. Nicole wants to know if Oakley is considered a wooly or a long-haired husky. I actually would say Oakley is probably more of just a long-haired husky. Her fur is definitely longer than Shelby's and Memphis's, but she's definitely not a full-on wooly husky. Um, she doesn't have that flowy coat. She just has a little bit longer of a coat. And as for brushing, I use a long-haired undercoat rake on her, and then I use my blower. Those are the best two things I have found that work with Oakley. Um, the Furminator doesn't work real great with Oakley. It definitely works better with the other two. But the blower and the long-haired undercoat rake seem to be what works best for me with Oakley. Crystal wants to know if there's enough snow yet for us to go sledding. Well, yes and no. We had some, and then it melted, and then it turned to ice, so it was too dangerous. And then that happened again, and then just again two days ago we had rain again, and now it's snowing again. So it's been really hit or miss on whether or not we can actually take them out on the trails. We're hoping sometime this week we'll actually be able to do it. It is snowing right now, but the base is icy, which can be dangerous for them. So hopefully this week we'll actually be able to take them out sledding. <laughs> we got some mail. We got some mail. Let's open it. We got a really super long letter from Lynn, and Lynn wants to know if Memphis is okay. As you guys know, she cut herself on the side of her face right there under her eye, and actually, we took her to the vet today just to be sure, because the fur is starting to grow in, but she's been itching it a lot. They checked it out, they said it's actually healing just fine, and that everything we did to it was the right thing to do, and that eventually that fur will grow back in, and the skin underneath that is dark won't be dark anymore. But they said she's healing just fine. And we got a beautiful letter from Laura with a drawing, and Laura wants to know what my favorite superhero is. I have no idea. Every time I think of superheroes, I think of my parents. So I guess that would be my answer. <laughs> and we got a book from Samantha. This is pretty cool with all of the dogs in it. What is Memphis's favorite thing? Love. Memphis's favorite thing is lug. Love. What are Oakley's spots on her nose? Why does Oakley have spots on her nose? I don't know. She just has freckles. She's special like that. This is definitely pretty cute. Thank you. We got a letter from Megan with some beautiful drawings of the dog. And Megan is from Michigan, just like us, and wants to know, how's Shelby doing? How are all the dogs doing? Do you plan on getting a puppy soon? Shelby and all the dogs are doing good. And, I don't know, maybe 2017 will be the year we add a dog to the pack. No decisions have been made as of yet. A letter and a drawing from Julia. A drawing from Gracie. We've got a card and a drawing from Monica, and Monica wants to know if we've noticed that Oakley's bark is different than the other dogs. It is, um, but Memphis is different too. A lot of dogs have really have a bark that's fairly unique to themselves. They all have their own voice. 
a letter and some drawings from Autumn. A beautiful letter from Braylee. This one is from Ruby. This is from Snoopy the Beagle. A beautiful letter from Brianna and her Chow Chow Mix Teddy. Brianna, your letter means more to me than you will ever know. Stay positive, you can do this. We got a letter from Lexi and Lexi says lately her dog seems really isolated and not happy. What can I do to make my dog happy again? I would say go for walks, go do some fun things outside, um, try to play. Sometimes dogs just need a new area. Go someplace you've never been before. I know, I know, you're so needy, you're so needy. Try going someplace you've never been before. Dogs like to experience new things, new smells. Look at your snow nose, it's so darn cute. We got a letter from Ginger and Miria. This is Ginger and they had some questions. Do you have any tips to calm a dog? Exercise is the best thing you can do to make a dog calm down. And uh, do you have any recommendations for dogs that is, I know, for a dog that is scratching but has no fleas? I would talk to your vet because it could be allergies. A beautiful letter from Mary, Jolene, Devin, Matthew, Montana, Chewbacca, Gizmo, and Zizix. And then this YouTuber sent us these. That one's for my mom and dad, and this one's for us. <laughs> it should say underneath here, may lick you to death. <laughs> Happy holidays from Serena. This is from Ellie. This is from Kaylee. This is from Layla. And this is from Valeria. We got letters from Riley and her sister Emily and some drawings, and Riley wants to know how old Oakley is. We just found out that she's actually 12 and a half. This one is from Cassandra, and they want to know when will it snow? Well, it's snowing right now, so I'd say right now. <laughs> and there was the picture on the back. These drawings are from Kendall. We got a letter from Sage who said they had cancer and when they were in the hospital they watch our videos to make them feel better. Well Sage, I hope you are feeling a ton better and I hope you have beat cancer. This one is from Lizzie and Jonathan or brownie underscore and muffin on Instagram. We got a letter, some photos from Sarah and this awesome drawing. That's pretty cool. A letter from Chloe and her sister Kalia with some drawings. This one's cool. It's all the dog's eyes. <laughs> and a beautiful letter from Tammy. Tammy, I absolutely loved reading your letter. Congratulations on the twins. And a beautiful letter from Crystal with some drawings of the dogs. We got a letter and a package from Vivian from Finland. Finland is Santa Claus land with a Christmas gift for the dogs. This package was sent from Lisa. There's her information with some treats for Jamie and I and some treats for the dogs. So first for this Fan Friday, we have a lot of Christmas cards that showed up after the Christmas card exchange video that we're gonna go through real fast. This is from Christine and Mo in Germany. This one was from Kim. This is from Spakey and Pia Marie in Germany. From Deepika. I'm sure I said that name wrong. Deepka, Deepka, something like that. From Anna. Sadly on these, I didn't write down the states and everything on each one. This one was from Sable the Husky, Shoppy the Terrier, Sarah and Jackson. Wendy from Taiwan. From Chelsea's dog family. From Natasha. Alice from England. Mia, Karen, and Bill. From the Salas family. I love all the pictures. Super cute. From Rain. From Scott and the Wannabe Snow Dogs. Irene from the Netherlands. Bonnie, Laszlo, Aspen, and Bear from Canada. I love your tree. That's super cute. Kristen from Germany. From Danica and their dogs. From Romy and Shia. This one is from Helen in Australia with a super cute drawing of Memphis on the inside. This one is from Kim and Sage. From Sammy. From Amber. From Amy in Scotland. A Christmas card and an awesome gift from Rue Dragon on YouTube. I, what? You like that card? That's a handmade card, by the way. And a Christmas card from Farah. All right, you guys, that's all we have for Fan Friday today. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Apparently, these two are going to go into full on wrestle mode. If you missed it, on Monday we put up our countdown video for 2016, our top 10 most viewed videos and top 10 favorite moments. <laughs> and then on Wednesday we put up a video of Memphis seeing her reflection in the oven door for the first time. Is this just, we're just gonna wrestle. This is just the way it is. We're just gonna wrestle. You tell them, they bumped into your butt, didn't they? <laughs>
<laughs> All right, you guys, if you're new to this channel and you like what you saw, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and share it with your friends to help us grow the audience. As always, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. You girls are nuts. Yeah, I know. You're crazy. Crazy. Bye, guys. Lots of fun, lots of walks, won't you come into our Siberia?